Hi Angel Gang, it's Midnight Maven. I was gonna go live for the first time tonight um, on Facebook, but I bitched out. I chickened out. It's it's so weird, it's stupid. It's like I'm doing this video right here for you, but I'm just scared to like talk to myself. And even so, I know somebody will still be able to get to watch it later after. I just, I that's the thing I'm gonna conquer by the end of this month is I'm gonna start doing the lives because I wanna connect with everybody and my tarot skills, my seer skills, because I'm a seer and I am a healer. That's something <clears throat> that I've always uh, had a gift for, but only certain people will know the extent of that and how much I heal. Uh, I'm not the next thing since sliced bread, but I am a pivotal force to co-create with, and I want to do that with y'all. So let's just see where our energies are at right now. This is kind of a freestyle one, and maybe one day when I'm, I stop being such a puss, we'll go live. What is the overall energy of the collective right now of Angel Gang Gang? Please tell me angels, ancestors, and ascendants. Nice. Three of Cups. Thanks, my track to six, six. The hangman. Seven of uh, swords in the reverse. Peace. Success unfulfilled. With the four of uh, pentacles and then the ace of pentacles. Um. We're learning to where we're seeing it from a another perspective, like the hangman right here. We're seeing it in another, uh, we're imbued with the vision um, to, to the chosen ones out there. And we see all the things that people try to pull and we just flick them off. And we stay at peace with our two of swords whenever we need to be. Whenever we need to see the other side, Nationwide is on your side. Like a good neighbor, State Farm is there. And then we get our libations on with the three cups. See, I'm starting to read different a little bit, like just more feeling it. In the past, we were over here tending crops and shit like that, feeling like Laura Ingalls and fucking Little House on the Prairie and shit. We wasn't getting anything in the in the summertime or when springtime, whenever the fucking fruit blossoms. Like, what the hell? I didn't planted a bunch of kudzu, kudzu plants, and they just killed everything. All these toxic, all this toxic trichonomics going around. Hail to the no. No, how we doing, Angel Gang? I just wanted to come and say hi, guys. I can't wait to hang out with it, everybody. We need to do a retreat. I know Queen Cup does one, um, but I would like to start another one. I'm in San Antonio, Texas. I don't know where everybody's at. If you are watching this, um, please comment in the, uh, the comment section uh, where you're from, and let's let's link up. Let's you know Facebook. I'm still learning Snapchat and TikTok. I'm showing my age. I'm 38. I feel so fucking old. I can't keep up with these whippersnappers, these damn Gen Zers, third wavers. I'm a second wave volunteer. To the chosen ones, you know exactly what I'm talking about. We're shooting the shit. So if you're here to just shoot the shit with me, this is what this whole video is about. As long as it gets to one person, this is what I, I'm just trying to have a conversation with my kinfolk. You know what I mean? My fellow um, angel gang gang. 
my other baby's kids. And real quick, I just want to say, first off, I'm really gross that I would pick my ear right here. It's me though. You'll get used to it, or maybe just turn a blind eye. But uh, uh, I've been noticing a lot of these tarot readers online, especially the ones that are up and coming, that have less than a thousand followers, or that within zero to five thousand followers. And I am so proud of all of us for sticking through it, and you know, um, shit, the real Pisces, the real Pisces. Are I'm so bad with names, I shouldn't even try to. I'm gonna butcher everybody, but my Pisces girl, uh, brother man, that white guy that preaches like nobody's business, he's the, the shit. Um, and a few of you other, uh, mostly I get along with, with chickies and uh, squints, a uh, uh, couple people. Anyways, wh whatever this is, I'm not trying to make it about me. I'm just trying to say that I see you guys and I can't wait for us to all come up together. And I'm glad we're part of the same class and it makes me feel really good. So back to the cards. Um, so yeah, in the past, <clears throat> the fruits of our labor were pretty much locified, lokied, but not in a good way. And so that made us very four of pentacles, like this shit's mine. Don't even try, don't even try to get up on it. You know, this shit's mine. I don't know who you talking to, but you know, it ain't me. And this is a weird hula shirt. I cut it. So this is the front and this is the back. But if I wear it the other way, my nipples show. And we don't want no nip slips going on, you know what I mean? Yeah, right now I'm just, I'm unhinged, but in a very, very good way. So, Mazel Tov. How we seek this Ace of Pentacles, um, Angel Gang, is by this reversed Four of Pentacles to where we're ready to take that leap of faith and give all of our time, energy, faith, love into our belief and our values and our purpose and what we're here to do in whatever sense or form, in whatever way. And I just have so much appreciation for me and who I'm becoming and you and everybody else that's out there being uh, light bearers. I have so much admiration for how unique each one of you is and how unique and uh, authentic we're becoming right before our eyes. It's so um, transcendent. You know what I mean? It's so beautiful. It just makes my soul smile because we're like little baby spirits or little baby deities running around and we've been doing it in private for I don't I don't know about y'all but I can assume it's anywhere from three years to 15 years I've been doing it for about seven to ten years uh, and it wasn't it started off because I wanted to get in the good graces of everything and just play by the rules of spirituality and everything and I think at first it is faking it it is the imposter syndrome reading tarot cards oh my god I'm still working on it now but I think the biggest thing is just showing up and being consistent and being transparent as much as you possibly can because sometimes we can't always be transparent you know what I mean we got to we got things, we got personal things that we have to, but whenever you do get a second or a chance to check in with the Angel Gang and say, hey, I'm here, we got this, we got this, you got this, we got this, baby. I love to do it and I love even having just a seat at the table because I've been waiting my whole life for this and so I'm really excited for all the things that we have.
have to come. So, I don't know. Somebody's gotta help my bitch ass go on a live. Somebody hand walk me to, the, to a live. It's half vanity because I, I want to get more followers because this is where we're doing this to communicate, to, to put our shit out there. But also it's half, it just needs to happen because I know that people that go live, like, um, shit, her name was Evolutionist 28 or 22. Now it's something, I, I, I forgot. She keeps changing her name, but she's this black chick. She's fucking fire. Titties all out all the time. She's like... What y'all doing over here? Like, you know, look, like, I'm like, fuck yeah. She's she's like, look at this motherfucker. He says he was, and I'm like, I, I fucking love her. If anything, she gives me the most joy from entertainment. She makes me feel protected and safe and a familiar face that's always on there and always consistent and always strong even when she kind of wavers a little bit i respect that so much out of her and out of everything that everybody that i follow and that follows me i just want to say i love you guys and uh yeah let's let's enterprise like share subscribe don't be a hater